I declare bankruptcy! He's always been terrible with money. I bet it's Jan spending him straight to the poorhouse. Yeah, women be shopping. I can't believe he has a second job. He's not even good at his first one. Hey, guys. What you talking about? Okay, I know what's going on. I'm talking about Jim and Pam. If they're having sex, what it looks like. I know. Michael. I think, hey, hey, hey. Michael? Are you having money problems? Monkey problems? No, I'm not having monkey problems. Why would I have monkey problems? I know you heard me correctly. Oh, I hate monkeys. What's going on? Why do you have a second job? I don't have a second job. Maybe I am having an affair with Suzanne Summers. Doesn't Jan have money? I don't talk to my girlfriend about money. It is rude and unsexual. True. It's best to hide our money problems from women. I totally agree with you. But I don't have money problems. I that. All right, you know what? Watch this. If I had money problems, would I do this? Well, you just put it in your pocket. Yeah. Yeah, but I destroyed it. It's it's not even usable anymore. What do you want to do for dinner? How about Chinese? She's really trying to save some money. That's something cheap. That was my cheap suggestion. Chinese was my cheaper suggestion. You do fast food? Fine. Fast food's fine. And then I just need you to sign here at this era. What kind of mortgage did you get? Uh, 10 year. Well, 10 over 30, so 30 year total. What? What? You said 10. 10 year fixed, over 30, 30 year total. Oh, 30 years. Okay, okay. okay. Wow, you'll be paying this off in your mid 70s. All right. <laughs> Forget about retiring when you're 65. Hey, I have an idea. You know that extra bedroom? If the whole girlfriend thing never happens, that's where the nurse can live. Okay, all right. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is it. Whenever you're ready. Yeah. Um. Oh. Oh, okay. Is that supposed to come off? Hey, look, cool. Actually, yeah. Carpenter ants. Um, I'm gonna take a little uh, breather for a second. Right. Excuse me. It'll be here waiting for you. Oh, man. A 30-year mortgage at Michael's age essentially means that he's buying a coffin. If I were buying my coffin, I would get one with thicker walls so you couldn't hear the other dead people. <sighs> oh. Whenever you're ready, Michael. Oh. Ceilings are lower than they were last week. That, I don't, I don't know if you showed me what? this same unit or not. And Michael, where, this is the unit Where you saw are and... all the hot people? I was told that there would be all these attractive singles. Who and as told far you as that? I can tell, I'm the best looking person here. There's a basic principle in real estate that you should never be the best looking person in the development. It's sort of common sense because if you are, then you have no place to go but down. Is this a financial thing? If it's a financial thing, what some people do is they rent out the third bedroom. No. And that's no, some extra no, 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 no. income I am for not you. going to rent the third bedroom. I want a price reduction or I am a walking. You will lose $7,000 if you walk away right now. I made the right decision. Hey, cuz. Heard you're having money problems. No, you didn't. Listen, I got the answer. You declare bankruptcy, all your problems go away. Creed Bratton has never declared bankruptcy. When Creed Bratton gets in trouble, he transfers his debt to William Charles Schneider. How would that help, Creed? In Monopoly, you go bankrupt, you lose. You don't go by Monopoly, man. That game is nuts. Nobody just picks up get-out-of-jail-free cards. Those things cost thousands. That is a good point. Bankruptcy, Michael, is nature's do-over. It's a fresh start. It's a clean slate. Like the witness protection program. Exactly. Not at all. I've always wanted to be in the witness protection program. Fresh start. No debts, no baggage. I've already got my name picked out. Lord Rupert Everton. I'm a uh, 
a shipping merchant who raises fancy dogs. That's the life. Hey, did you guys register for wedding gifts? We did, but mostly because people expect us to. We're also accepting other gifts, not on the registry. However much. It's awkward asking people for money, but we could really use it. Why doesn't Crate and Barrel let you register for a toaster full of cash? Heard you guys are looking for cash for the wedding? Yeah, I mean, if it's all the same for you. Question for you. Would you guys rather have $100 now or $5,000 a year from now? $100 now, for sure. Because you just give me $50 to cover the broker fee. I put in 100 of my own money as the gift. Yeah, no. No, I'll, um, the 100. I'll just take the 100. Instead of $5,000 a year from now. How sure is this? The guy has an algorithm to determine the winner of any given college basketball game. Don't tell Jim. I declare bankruptcy! Hey, I just wanted you to know that you can't just say the word bankruptcy and expect anything to happen. I didn't say it, I declared it. Still, that's... It's not anything. I just love sales. I love it to death. It's as simple as that. And I don't get to do enough of it as a manager, so I took this second job, kind of as a hobby. Some people have golf for relaxing. This is a lot of credit card debt. Yeah, tell me about it. Mm -hmm. You know, Jan has my credit cards, and she's using them as if I'm made of money. She thinks I'm a human ATM machine. Okay, $125, Amazon. Oh, Best of the Muppet Show on DVD, classic. $1,200, what's a core blaster extreme? That is by far the best way to strengthen your core. This machine, you sit on a stabilizer ball, you put your feet into the power stirrups, you reach up and you grab onto the super rod and you twist and you twist and you twist it strengthens your entire core. Your back core, your arm core, your... The Marine Corps actually uses it. I think that's how they got core. Okay, the green bar is what you spend every month on stuff you need, mm -hmm. like a car and a house. That's so cool how you have my name at the top. The red bar is what you spend on non-essentials, like magazines, entertainment, right. things like that. This scary black bar is what you spend on things that no one ever, ever needs, like multiple magic sets, professional bass fishing equipment. How did you do this so fast? Is this PowerPoint? Man. Angela really had a hold on him. Angela. Michael, I'm going to set you and Jan up with a debt consolidator. Oh, no, you meet with this guy. No, you, we are going to leave Jan out of this. She has to know. We will find another way. We'll ask PowerPoint. Michael, this is a presentation tool. You're a presentation tool. If you think I'm going to tell Jan about this. I'm done. No, you're not. Okay, just... You're not a tool. Look, we'll tell her that it's bad, but it could have been a lot worse, but due to some fancy financial footwork, I was able to cut it in half. Jen is smart. She posts.